Join us for a train ride with Verena Ringler, who helps prepare the ground for the next EU. Doing things differently to do different things is what she proposes. In February 2019, I listened to experts at the Munich Security Conference. They ask, how can Europeans be strong in this world of disruption and disorder? Can a new doctrine help? Let's call it strategic sovereignty? Well, here is my answer. European power starts at home and the strongest power is the one that emanates from the people. People are strong when they know each other and maybe even trust each other. When they talk to each other rather than about each other. When they are united rather than divided. Today we have loud and clear evidence for the fact that every euro spent on human contact across borders within the EU, we call these people-to-people -people programs is a euro well invested. These euros produce a sense of trust, a sense of togetherness, of Europeanness. So every euro invested on high school exchanges rather than highway projects helps to build the European power base. What is the EU doing to bring people together in its new seven-year budget plan? Well, not enough yet. And I learned that policymakers and budgeters systematically overestimate the impact of so-called cohesion and regional funds, while they still systematically underestimate the amazing impact of these people-to-people -people programs. So whoever wants a strong European people, whoever wants a strong European power base, has to turn budget priorities upside down back home. People to people is the most effective and the most efficient way to build this European power base. Strategic sovereignty starts at home and it starts with people to people first.